Hey guys, so um, I'm just going to be doing a review on the Too Faced Natural Eye Palette and um, I've got, I got this quite a while ago, um, probably like half a year ago and um, I don't actually use it all that much. I did go through a phase where I used it basically every day but um, since then I haven't really used it much and um, I really should go back to it because I was just like playing around with my makeup collection tonight and um, I went around swatching all of them and I realized um, a lot of them are excellent dupes for um, some of the MAC eyeshadow colors. They're probably even better quality because most of these feel like um, Velux pearls. So basically it comes like this. It's like a little cardboard box and it says Too Faced Natural Eye Eyeshadow Palette. And then it's magnetic here so you pull it open and it's got this little the nine eyeshadows which are all great neutral colors and then in here there are like some three cards and here they are so basically these eyeshadows are set out in like um like like preset um eye looks for you so you have a day look here with the three colors across and then the classic and then fashion but obviously you can mix and match um whatever you like but they have some ideas for you, like for the day look it says Sweep Heaven, which is the lightest color, uh, from lashes to brow, blend velvet revolver into the crease, line upper and lower lash line with sex espresso, and blend. And I actually do that look a lot, that was a look I did um, basically every day for um, uh, like probably a month or two. But it, it wasn't because of this card, it was because I just thought they would look the best and the most natural because those three colors are all matte. And then like they just have the same kind of... Um, suggestions for the classic look and then the fashion look as well so that's just really cute and it slots into the box like this okay and then down here there's like a little drawer with um, an applicator it has like the sponge tip applicator on one end and then an eyeshadow liner here which is actually like a brush which is pretty cool I don't really use them though but okay to the main point of this video I'm gonna swatch all these eyeshadows for you and let you know like what um, dupes, like what colors they would be in MAC. So first of all we have Heaven on the top left corner. It's like a matte cream shade and this is like that. It looks a bit chalky but it's actually really soft. Um, this would basically be Brulee from MAC which is a satin and then next Velvet Revolver is like a sort of dirty light brown color and that's basically Omega or Malt. I don't have like either of those shades but I've seen them and that looks pretty much like uh, Malt or um, Omega or maybe uh, Soba even. And then Sexpresso would be like Espresso, just like a very dark brown matte color. Okay, let me wipe these off and then we can continue. Next we have Silk Teddy which is this, sh it looks like a shimmery um, pink but actually once you swatch it, it is so soft, and look at that pigmentation, it's amazing, and it's super metallic. I'm guessing this would be like Honey Lust from MAC. And then Push Up, looks like this, and how amazing does that look? I'm guessing this would be, well this looks a bit like a more golden and more metallic version of Woodwinked. So there you go. And um, I'm actually going to compare Woodwinked for you, so just hold on a second. Okay, I've got Woodwinked here, and um, I'll swatch that for you. So, okay, that's Woodwinked, and this is Push Up. So, as you can see, they look very similar. Actually, Woodwinked looks, looks a bit more gold, and um, Push Up's a bit more brown, but definitely looks like the same finish. Like, all three of these basically look like Velux Pearls, but you would never know that these two are Too Faced. So that is excellent. Um, okay, next is Erotica. And I'm going to swatch it with Cocoa Puff as well. So Erotica up here. And Cocoa Puff just below it. Okay, so Cocoa Puff first. This is Cocoa Puff. And how much does that look like Nars Mekong? Like seriously, that is Nars Mekong. Like a really dark, warm brown with gold shimmer. That's exactly what Nars Mekong is. And then Erotica is basically the same but a cool tone that's erotica and that is cocoa puff so they're gorgeous 
And then we've got Honey Pot, which is a like a pure gold color. Look at that. These are all amazing finishes. That would be, what would that be? Probably Honey Lust in MAC. Yeah. Um, okay. And then there's one left, and it is Nude Beach, which is this really, really chunky, glittery, light pink one. And I never wear this one because it's just too chunky for me. Like, you can see how chunky that is, but it is, it is, it is a nice color. Um, it's basically silk teddy, but with a lot of chunky glitter. So that's silk teddy, and this is Nude Beach. So, um, this isn't really really excellent neutral palette um, I will be utilizing it more um, you know this summer because I am on a spending ban I didn't mention this yet but I'm on a spending ban until the first of July so I'm not allowed to buy any makeup items unless they're like replacement products like um if I run out of foundation concealer you know, skincare products, or like, um, I just lost my Shiseido eyelash curler, so I'm allowed to buy like a replacement. Um, but other than that, I'm putting myself on a spending ban for unnecessary makeup items that I do not need because I've been overspending uh, lately, uh, especially on makeup and clothes, so I thought I should cut down and yeah. Um, and sort of appreciate what I have already and um, put them to good use. Yeah, and sort of just, um, you know, like for example this palette, I haven't used it in a long time. I should get back into it because it is an excellent palette. Um, so yeah, those are all the colors again. So this is basically brulee, this is like soba or malt or omega, this is espresso, this would be, um, this would be, what did I say, uh, Honey Lust? But it basically looks exactly the same as Honey Pot, but a bit lighter. So these are both like champagne-y, even though they look like pink and gold. This would be Woodwinked, but slightly more brown. This, these two, this would be a true dupe for NARS Mekong. And this is a cooler toned version of that. And this is just a chunky version of the one above. So, excellent palette. Um, I think it was about... 20 pounds, so that would probably be, 20 pounds would be 40, 40, no, 30 US, yeah, 30 US dollars, um, excellent quality, stays on all day, when I use these three, I use um, that all over the lid, this as a liner, and so it gives a really soft look, and this um, for a brow highlight, and to blend out the all over eye color. So yeah, that is the Too Faced Natural Eye Palette. Highly recommend it if you can find it. I'm sure Too Faced is really readily available in the US and in the UK you can find it at Bigger Boots stores. Um, yeah, so that was my review on it and I hope it was helpful and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.